Welcome to Cooking with Whatever from Angie's Kitchen. Today we are going to see rice cauliflower. I have two heads of cauliflower here. Just clean them, cut into small chunks, wash them. That's all the prep work you need. If you have a food processor, well and good. If you do not have, no worries about it. You can use the food, uh, the grater. But if you have messed up hands like me, my strong suggestion is please get a food processor. I have a Cuisin Art, um, not promoting anything, but I just love it. Uh, don't put everything as a bulk in one setting, make it job easy. Actually, that's more work because it will not do a good job. So I did uh, in three batches for pulsing anywhere from seven to 10 times pulse it. Do not turn the on mode button because uh, you know my mom was asking uh, which means will it not come to a chutney consistency i said no mom because with pulsing it will not go to that consistency rather than that like super fine rice uh, the texture will be so good even if you're not a big fan of cauliflower trust me you will like it so in three batches pulse mode seven to ten times i think i did like ten times and again, do not dump it. I've done it and it's more work. Trust me on that. So in a nonstick pan, I transferred everything. For the whole batch, I'm using maybe two or two and a half tablespoons of water. I have a quarter cup of water here. Look, I'm not even using a quarter, complete quarter cup. Just sprinkling it a couple of times and three times at the most. That's all. If you have a number on your stove knob, the number is four or medium high for eight minutes. Only because it is two heads of cauliflower, I'm using eight minutes. If it is just one small head for one person, four to five minutes is more than enough. You'll get a nice cooked cauliflower smell. It is done. Now with this, <clears throat> there are so many uh, varieties you can do. Let me just uh, give you a few which are my favorite ones. I love lemon rice, riced cauliflower lemon rice, I love it. Thai sadam or yogurt rice, which I'll be showing soon, I love that. Pongal is another South Indian uh, traditional uh, breakfast or dinner, whenever you, you can have. I tried cauliflower riced pongal, so good. Fried rice, really good. Biryani, really good. Or even otherwise, as the plain rice, as a rice substitute, you can pour chicken curry, you can have fish curry, you can have sambar, you can rasam, anything you want, pour over that rice and eat. It's just substitute for rice. If you're thinking about transferring like, you know, healthy eating, this is the best substitute, I will say. In fact, the night for our dinner was, my mom had made beef chukka, so beef, rasam and cauliflower rice and also she had prepared mint chutney so mint chutney and talicha thair sadam or yogurt rice was our dinner what more can a person ask it was really good you know so for the yogurt rice or the thair sadam you temper it you season it so in a pan just one tablespoon of oil quarter teaspoon of mustard seeds you allow it to pop three fourth teaspoon of white urad dal and then my mom, my head chef said, a pinch of uh, cumin seeds. I say, I usually don't do because she said, okay, let me do it. And she said, oh, this kitchen smells so good. I said, yeah, mom, I've never smelled really good before. Only because I added cumin, it's smelling so good. <laughs> and then I added a pinch of uh, ginger green chilies cilantro leaves and curry leaves just for a few seconds you uh, season it that's it it's done so in the plain rice cauliflower you add yogurt plain yogurt you can use fat free uh, partly fat like you know i'm using whole milk yogurt fire is my favorite uh, i'm using like three quarters of a cup add a little bit water because it's really super thick yogurt just like maybe two tablespoons of water and add some salt and mix it well and add the seasoning and your yogurt rice is ready or in tamil as we say talicha thair sadam the only difference is rather than rice you're using riced cauliflower friends 
it will hit the spot it's very filling it's healthy it's local food chris loves it my brother loves it i like it it's not that i can eat it every day sometimes i get tired i mix rice or i can mix quinoa do it whatever pleases you you don't have to eat this every day mix it and eat if for starters if it is if you find it difficult so that day as i said we had plain rice cauliflower with rasam and beef as a side dish and uh, thair sadam and mint chutney was our dinner and it was so good you know especially in hot summer months this will be so cooling to your body thank you guys thank you so much for watching now i'm going to transfer the camera back to our head chef who is uh, still in jet lag who's still jet lag and yet she was able to prepare mint chutney and uh, beef uh, gravy for us supervisor head chef enna ye panninga iniki head chef mint chutney na poi thotathula poi fresh ah parichittu vande pudina chutney arachu ஓகே குட் ஜாப் அதுதான் செம்ம டேஸ்ட்டு நானும் டேஸ்ட் பண்ண நல்லா இருந்துச்சு எனக்கு இடுப்பு பிடிச்சிக்கிச்சு ஸோ நிறைய வேலை அவங்க தான் பண்ணுறாங்க பாவம் பட் எனி ஹவ் தேங்க்யூ கைஸ் தேங்க்யூ ஸோ மச் ஃபார் வாட்சிங் லவ் யூ ஆல் பபாய் ஃப்ரம் ஆஞ்சிஸ் கிச்சன் பாய் சொல்லுங்கம்மா சத்தமாக சொல்லுங்கள் ஜெட்லாக்கில் உட்காண்ட்ருக்காங்க